What's up today, Tyrannus lovers? I'm going to show you a little trick here to help you find some videos so you don't have to go searching all the time. Now, as you can see, I have OpenTX 2.1.1 in here. Uh, and you also want to make sure that you're on videos. Once you get that, you want to come down to the bottom of the page and you want to create an alert. And we're going to create an alert. Uh... Okay, there's what I'm looking for. Uh, and this is what it's going to ask you once you pop into this. Uh, uh, it's going to ask you a few questions here on what you want to do. I want mine uh, as it happens. As soon as somebody posts the video, I want to know about it. I want to know that it's a video, uh, whatever, uh, whatever language you speak. Uh, I put any region. Uh, all results, and then my email address, uh, and then update alert. Okay, so now anytime that a, a video is made on the 2.1.1, it's automatically going to go to your email box. You're going to open it, click on the video, and then click straight to the video and go straight to YouTube. Uh, this is how I find all my videos all the time. This is way much easier than me going to YouTube and typing in the search bar looking for something. I just create an alert for it, and it, it just comes out a lot easier. And as soon as that video comes up, uh, I have it. I just wanted to show you that. Now, I had 2.1.1 on my radio. Uh, there's some things I liked about it, but there's some things I didn't like about it. So I reverted back to the 2.017. Uh, if you want to run an LUA telemetry screen script, you're going to have to go back to 2.015. Uh, to get that, that LUA script to work. Uh, it won't work on 2.017, or I couldn't get it to work, uh, but I don't use them anymore anyway. So if you get it to work on 2.017, uh, more power to you. Uh, I don't use, I don't want to be looking at my screen when I'm flying. All I want to do is be able to flip my switch on and my telemetry on cells, cells, uh, RSSI, and the battery that's in the Tyrannus reads out to me every 30 seconds so I know exactly what the flight battery is doing. Uh, that's the way I like it. That's the way I'm going to keep it until I figure out how to get it all set up on the 2.1.1. I just haven't had time. I'm working uh, 10 hours a day, six days a week, so I just haven't. I haven't even had time to fly. So uh, or play around with the radio. Right now, I, I'm just get, I'm getting ready to go to bed now because it's around eight o'clock here now, uh, here in Missouri. So I just wanted to show you this trick. Uh, hopefully, this will help you. Uh, Find those videos a lot quicker. On You can do this on any video that you're looking for. Uh, you can create an alert for it. Uh, some of you may have known this, and some of you may not have known this. But this is the way I do it. And so I just had one pop into my mailbox the other day. It's that very first one you're looking at right there, the GPS compass right there, our comparison. Uh, uh, that really didn't show up anything. Right now, I don't see anybody making any videos on the 2.1.1. I've seen a lot of confusion where people were using it, and then they reverted back to an older firmware. Uh, I've seen just about everybody do that. So uh, there's nobody out there really playing with the 2.1.1. Uh, I don't have time right now, So, but if you do play with it and you figure out something, uh, post a video on YouTube and it will go straight to my email box. So there you go, guys. There's a little trick for you. Everybody have a good one.